we're going to define the outside edge of that. And then it's going to come around here. And I'm going to get a more curved one. And so it twists around there. All right, now I'm going to come in and do this part first. This is going to flow over. This part here, that corner, has to be rounded off. Just take that corner right off, look like it's curving around. And then come in here. here down about halfway and take that whole area down and right at the edge here little curve and then come in here going again about halfway down At the edge here, it should look like it's much more curved. Okay, and I think we're sort of, this is looking kind of square, so I need to reconfirm that curve right there. Okay, and um, again right here, this is looking a little square, so if I take that and just round it off a little bit more, and define that. Okay, now, very close, now I'm going to come in here and do that little cut. And again, this is sometimes where things show up that might be an issue. Areas where you might want to curve it a little bit more. cleaning up to do here. Still not looking real flowing. So we're getting the idea, the general idea of these folding over. So this should really look like it's all of this was removed and that should look like it's just flowing right into that area. 
you see how the cloth sort of folded over and um, draping and it does really give a really good shadow effect and give that three-dimensional look. It's actually, it looks a lot deeper than it actually is. If you look at that from the profile, you see it's really not very deep. So when you look at it straight on, it's got a lot more depth to it just by that optical illusion of the edge of that piece of cloth.